UN Security Council to vote tomorrow on call for Trump's Jerusalem. The United Nations Security Council is due to vote on Monday on a resolution drafted by Egypt against U.S. President Donald Trump's unilateral recognition of the city as Israel's capital. The draft UN resolution affirms that any decisions and actions which purport to have altered the character, status or demographic composition of the holy city of Jerusalem have no legal effect, are null and void and must be rescinded in compliance with relevant resolutions of the Security Council. It calls upon all states to refrain from the establishment of diplomatic missions in the holy city of Jerusalem, pursuant to Resolution 478-1980 of the Security Council. However, there is debate regarding the definition of diplomatic missions, and whether that relates to an embassy or a consulate as well. Diplomats say it has brought support, but will likely be vetoed by Washington. Trump abruptly reversed decades of U.S. policy this month generating outrage from Palestinians and defying warnings of Middle East violence. Trump also plans to move the U.S. Embassy to Jerusalem from Tel Aviv. In opening remarks at Sunday's cabinet meeting, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu thanked U.S. President Donald Trump for what the Prime Minister called the President's determination and leadership in defending the truth on Israel and for rebuffing attempts to use the United Nations as a platform against Israel. Israel's Ambassador to the U.N., Danny Dannon denounced the draft resolution Saturday. During a period in which the Jewish people is celebrating the liberation of Jerusalem nearly 2,000 years ago, the Palestinians continue to try to reinvent history, he said, referring to the holiday of Hanukkah. No voter debate will change clear reality. Jerusalem is and has always been the capital of Israel. We will continue along with our allies to fight for